a mud pot located about five miles northwest of Nyland, California, is making history because it's moving and mud pots are not supposed to move. It first appeared in 1953 and it was a typical stationary mud pot until around 2007 when it began to move westward toward the railroad tracks. The railroad placed a metal barrier in its path to try to stop it. It didn't work and the mud pots took out the railroad tracks. The fiber optic cables in the area were placed on poles to cross the water which was produced by the mud pot. Highway 111 was moved 100 feet west and soon the old 111 will be undercut by the water from the mud pot. Nearby, the Salton Sea levels are slowly declining. More mud pots are being revealed, such as this field near Mullet Island on the eastern edge of the Salton Sea. Just a few years ago, these mud pots were underwater. Caltrans in 2019 completed a steel pile wall to convey water to a gravel wash and a subsurface drain to convey the water beneath the roadway to another gravel wash. They also constructed a detour road to reroute the traffic from State Route 111. The railroad has now moved its tracks to east of the mud geyser. As the mud pots move on its way to the west, life must go on. The railroads must maintain their schedules and the roads must be open for commerce. Follow the adventures of the moving mud pot on DesertUSA.com as it moves west. <laughs>